I'm just going to show you guys a quick calisthenics workout you can do with just the floor and uh, a bar. So first we're gonna do some pull-ups right here. So I just got this bar right up there. I'm just gonna jump up and then feet together, relax your shoulders, pull up, chest to the bar, relax your shoulders, pull up, chest to the bar, relax your shoulders. and just do three sets to absolute failure on that one. And then we're gonna rest for, uh, I don't know, a few minutes probably. And then just whenever your hands are ready, uh, gonna go down and we're going to do some push-ups. One second, I'm trying to get this. So you wanna keep your back straight your ass up, uh, your butt up, and uh, push down, push up, all the way down, practically kissing the floor, up, down, up, see it, I'm keeping my back straight, whole time, my elbows aren't flaring out like this, that's not a push up, uh, at least not in the way we want it to hit our triceps and chest. Elbows in, all the way down, all the way up. And for a vertical view, down, up, down, up. Just like that. Do three sets to your absolute failure and then rest for a few minutes until you're ready. And then we're going to do, let's see, we can do squat jumps. Okay. Squat down. Explode up. And try and slowly land try and control your land you don't want to just land you want to descend you want to descend your body so down explode up descend explode up descend explode up descend and you're just trying to gain as much height as you possibly can and just get that explosive jumping. And, and it's okay if you're faltering at your last few repetitions, just finish them out till failure. Uh, when I do squat jumps, I typically fail them and then I, I quite literally collapse to the floor um, if I go to failure. Do three sets to my absolute failure, then rest for a little bit, rest for a few minutes. Okay, so we've gotten uh, pull-ups will be hitting your uh, biceps your back and uh, shoulders and then we have push-ups so chest and triceps uh, triceps <laughs> that's not triceps shoulders and um, we have squat jumps so just kind of lower body and like your quads mainly and just getting that explosive speed up and down and um, I mean for the pull-up bar if you don't have any bar uh, or a tree limb then you don't have to, then well you can't do pull-ups really there's no really good good uh, back exercises that will work your back enough um, as much as pull-ups do so try to find a tree limb a bar whatever you can find and then we're going to do, um, let's see, so we got, 
You can also do squats if you have something heavy. Um, right here, I have my backpack. So I'm gonna be using this. You can also use a cinder block or uh, a tiny, tiny little boulder or something. So if you have a backpack and you're wanna, wanting to squat it, then I would say probably get at the base of it. Sort of like this. Okay. And then down, up, down, up. First side view. Down, up, down, up. And do those for uh, three sets of as many repetitions until failure. And that will be your uh, at home workout that you can do, or really anywhere uh, except for the bar. But the bar will be very useful if you're trying to get that back, get that broad shoulders, nice V taper build. And stay consistent on this. Pick a time every day that you know you can do it. So if your whole day is busy, there's still not an excuse. You can just wake up really early. And yes, it will suck. You might not always feel like it every day, but you gotta do it every day. You have to create that discipline. You also have to have the willpower to not eat crap food, to not go watch porn, not waste your life scrolling social media and whatever. And if you wanna like, learn more about this and self-improvement just go on youtube and look up uh, like hamza's full guides i can link those in the description not affiliated with him or anything but i think his full guides are very informational and if you just watch those you don't need to watch any of his other videos because he kind of just compacts it all into these uh probably one one to four hour guides the longest one is four hours that one's about money though and um yeah that's all i got for you guys today have a great day and god bless